Hello Metzos, my name is Jeff Rolka. I want to thank you for checking out my video. I had a request for some staccato exercises. And these are some of my favorite exercises. I think that they offer us the best opportunity to be really, really efficient in how we work with our voices to get the absolute most out of them. And these are two of my favorite exercises that I'm going to show you. Before I do though, thank you if you've chosen to subscribe and if you haven't yet, I hope that you will consider doing so now. YouTube has recently uh, gotten rid of fan funding, um, but I still very graciously and gratefully accept donations via my website, jeffrolka.com. If you head over there, you can learn all about it. You can also work with my triple A method, which is a step-by-step -step singing method to uh, work on your voice. So, <clears throat> staccato notes, we will be most successful with staccato articulations if we focus primarily on our expansion of the rib cage laterally and the engagement of the rectus abdominis muscles, the so-called like six pack, and the engagement of the other core body muscles such as the obliques and the intercostals. This exercise, the first one, has a short breath in between each of the articulations. <laughs> Try to notice the position of your tongue. Try to notice what your jaw is doing. Use a mirror and monitor these things. If you see that your tongue is jumping all over the place, try and keep it still. If your jaw is bumping along, try and keep it still. If you notice a glottal attack, e, 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 that is probably indicative of not quite enough engagement or preparation prior to the tonal onset. Be focused on your engagement. Conversely, if you hear too much aspiration, he, 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 that is a poor adduction of the vocal fold. It's not closing. You might try these exercises with a we for practice. You, however, can practice right here to start. And The next exercise has a scale attached to it. I want to stress that how you do these exercises is far more important than if you can simply sing the notes. Most, most people I would expect would be able to sing each of those pitches without too much difficulty, but we're listening very, very carefully to the sound of those articulations, to the crispness of the notes, to the presence or lack thereof of a glottal attack or the presence or lack thereof of an aspiration to the vocal fold. We really are looking and listening for a balanced sound to the voice. And again, you will be most successful by putting the primary parts of your focus on the lateral expansion of your ribcage and the engagement of your core body muscles. The next exercise sounds like this. There are no breaths in between the staccato pitches and you are challenged to maintain your engagement. And you can begin here. Two, ready, and.
And there you go. I do hope that helps. My name is Jeff. Take really good care of your voices. Enjoy singing, and hopefully we'll see you again. Bye.